people, Drake here again with another Minecraft tutorial, and today I bring you a flush with the floor torch key. Now, Exumavoid just featured his model of this on his channel. Um, I've basically taken his design and his idea, I've redesigned it, it is a little bit more compact, and it doesn't use a detector rail, rather it uses a uh, secondary block of redstone instead. So basically, you just place your torch here on this block, it will power the piston, send out a quick redstone pulse, and then the piston will extend back up, like this. And basically, your output lines are here and here and then you can take those and power whatever you want but for the sake of the tutorial I'll just power these redstone lamps so as you can see there is your output Okay, so before we begin, I do want to stress that this was not my original idea and concept. All credit should go to Exumavoid for coming up with this idea. I have just taken it and redesigned it. So that being said, these are the following items that you will need to build my concept here. You will need roughly six building blocks of any type, three pieces of redstone dust, one redstone comparator, one redstone repeater, two sticky pistons, one furnace, and two blocks of redstone. Then you will also need one additional item of any kind that you can store inside the furnace, that way the comparator can pick up on the signal, and you will also need a redstone torch, obviously, to activate the system to begin. Okay, so to begin building this, you want to first find out where your key block is going to be. I'm just going to place mine right here like this. Then you want to skip down one block and place your sticky piston so that there is one block gap between those. To the left of that sticky piston, you want to place your block of redstone with a piece of redstone dust on top. And you'll notice that this sticky piston is now powered. Now, right above this redstone dust that you just placed, you want to place your furnace with your one item inside. And like I said, that item can be whatever you want. And then on the other side of that sticky piston, you're going to place a block with your comparator facing outward. Place a block in front of that comparator. Place a block to the side, just like this. One block jutting down. And then one block on the side of that sticky piston. Now place a piece of redstone dust here, your repeater inside this groove, a piece of redstone dust here, and then place your other sticky piston on the side of this furnace and to right to the side of this piece of redstone dust. And then you can place your other block of redstone. And you'll notice now that this redstone here has turned into a line instead of a pile of dust, which is exactly what we want. So, if you place your torch, the system will fire and then reset. And just like that. Alrighty guys, that is it for this tutorial. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please remember to drop me a like down below. If you really liked it, press that shiny red subscribe button, favorite, and share it with your friends. Drop me comments, all of that good stuff. Thank you guys, and I will see you next time.